Looking at the district leading the state in active cases, Fort Smith also has reported the most cumulative cases, reporting 95 positives since mid-June. KNWA's Clarice Busmonte in Fort Smith with how administrators are responding. Christina Williams with Fort Smith Schools tells me if this information is concerning for parents, they have until Wednesday at noon to switch their child to all virtual learning. She says the district has been consistently reminding parents of this through text messages and social media posts. For students who will continue learning in person, Williams says the school will ramp up its already daily cleaning routine. She also mentions the security and facilities team will do more fogging, which is spraying disinfectant on each surface of the school. I would, I would just say uh, for, for parents that we are taking the necessary precautions to the greatest extent possible and that student and staff safety continues to be our number one priority. Northside High School has canceled its football practices and games this week due to concerns of COVID-19 exposure. I asked Williams if she expects any more sporting events to be canceled due to the virus and she says right now it's hard to tell but Fort Smith is not the first and likely won't be the last that has to cancel for these reasons. In Fort Smith, Claire Sweet Monte, KWA Northwest Arkansas.